It just won't go away. It won't go away now. Uh, popcorn's done me for the day, I'm afraid. Nicole <laughs> says, <laughs> cross your legs. Now, when you cross your legs, I'm done for. <laughs> I can't, I can't stop, 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 I'm fine, I'm fine, I'm fine, I'm fine, I'm fine. Nicole says my favourite food combination is crispy bacon and cocoa pops. <laughs> Not funny. <laughs> and all the, all the time this is happening, Rick, Rick's good. Field is gone. Holly Willoughby also has left the ITV franchise. Ladies and gentlemen, the question now on social media seems to be getting very interesting about the fate of ITV's major uh, program this morning uh, show. What really is the fate of this morning program? And is indeed the show really going to be scrapped off completely as some have also wished or anticipated? find out in this interesting report we do have for you this is the trends on pinax news we will appreciate the fact that you log on to our pinaxnews.com that's where you can find the latest from the world of art entertainment for more news also please do well to subscribe to our platform here then you can get great content also your thought and comments will be appreciated in the comment section join us today let's get interactive now we all do know that philip schofield apparently has taken a bow from the itv hosting this morning program little did we know that an explosive uh, you know, controversial statement about the essence police also alleging that a 36 year old man, Gavin Plapp, was plotting some attack at the queen of the ITV franchise, Holly, uh, Holly Willoughby. Now, interestingly, in the, in the heat of this whole controversy and kidnap issue, Holly apparently issued a statement claiming that her safety is at stake now and she needed some time uh, to also pay attention to her safety and of course to her family then we saw an interesting letter coming from her taking a bow from hosting itv program now the interesting conversation that really has sparked on social media is the fact that the show seemed to be losing its value also interesting conversation uh you know on social media uh, by some major and ardent viewers of the show say that the show currently as we speak has lost its value and looks like the itv franchise would have to restructure everything or maybe possibly just scrap it off what what really is your thought about this i don't know but basically well we can um for for me per, i mean for instance i think maybe uh they can do something very interesting about it but this is not my personal uh you know uh say over here the social media people over there really seem to be giving some interest and thought about it but the management apparently are trying so hard to restructure uh you know strategize things but information we are also gathering indicates that there could be a possibility that this morning program as we all do watch and laugh to watch could be getting itself off this uh, you know the scene for some time now until uh, you know further notice well i don't know so much about that but that is the confirmation so far uh, that is coming from various insiders who really seem to know about it but speaking about scrapping i know the tv program from tv i really would have watched that maybe the ITV franchise think twice about this before losing major viewers on their screens. Well, let's do revisit some interesting visuals by this morning family. When they did win big at the National Television Award, you could see how this crew apparently do love what they do. But before that, what really will be your favorite personality so far at the ITV franchise? Please let us know what you think about it in the comment section. And if you also think that, the, I mean, the This Morning Show program should be scrapped completely, from the ITV, uh, you know, uh, franchise. Let us know what exactly your thought is about this. So let's do enjoy this interesting video uh, at the ITV family and to see how uh, all of them really seem very happy together. Unfortunately, looks like all of them seem to be leaving one after the other. So currently, it is Holly Willoughby, but previously it was Philip Schofield. Who is next to take an exit from ITV franchise? Well, time will tell. This morning. <laughs>
Congratulations. 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 Please don't think we ever get complacent, and please don't think we ever take this for granted. This means so much to us every year, especially this year. We have the most amazing team, I have the best friend, we have the best boss, all our lucky. team are up there. Thank you so much, this award means everything because it is voted by... has a very special relationship with you. You make our show for us, you really do. Um, all these guys are on the stage here, Alison and Dharma, <laughs> Rochelle and Vernon, the whole team that are here, Josie, everybody that is part of this, all of these guys up here, ITV, Kevin Ligo, the whole team, thank you for your ongoing support. I think, I think Ali should have a word. Go on. Yeah. award honestly I think this morning is a mood I ain't gonna lie now we all know I should have won one of these as well <laughs> but you know what Bradley Walsh Graham Norton and the legends that and to deck are amazing but let's be honest I should have won one any but this morning got one any Super, super beautiful family who apparently uh, worked at the ITV franchise, then been, uh, you know, led by Philip Schofield and, uh, you know, uh, Holly Willoughby. But unfortunately, looks like the split between these two have really caused so much. But of course, like I did say, the conversation really seems to be going over that these, uh, you know, should to uh, come back or they should apparently the show at the entirety should be scrapped off. Should I, should I really give my thought and comment about it? Well, funny enough, I'm not, I'm not really going to say much about it, but in my personal view, I think Alison is doing so well, Gibson is also doing so well, and the platform apparently is huge enough to occupy everyone I know on that particular side. And so scrapping it off entirely will really, in my personal view, cause a bit of problem to the franchise. But of course, I'm not going to meddle in the business partners, uh, you know, uh, matters so much so your thought and comments apparently uh, will be appreciated in the comment section let us know what you think about it just in case you miss uh you know holly will it be uh well she apparently has taken about from the itv franchise um she issued a statement some time back and apparently uh it took social media by storm with another explosive uh, you know, report by the essence police of the 36 year old man who tried to kidnap him. But we'll try and get you up to speed of information as and when we do here. This has been the Chase Opinax News. Thanks for watching.